Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Japanese class. This is class number 24, and we're going to listen to conversation that is equivalent to N5 level. So, here's the content for today. First, we're going to listen to long conversation. Second, we're listening to question sentences. And third, we're going to learn some new phrase with grammar. And lastly, we're going to listen to short conversation. First, let's listen to the long conversation. はい、Okay, so before I begin translating the sentences,、um, this conversation is pretty long, so I have divided it into two sides. First, the woman says, Hi, Midori Toshokan des. Yes, this is Midori Library. Midori is Uh, the name of the library. However, in Japanese, I mean, in English, this is green. So if I wanted to translate Midori, it will be green toshokan, so library, green library. Ano sochira made do yatte ikimasu ka? How do I get there? Sochira means、um, the polite way of saying soko. Honda eki kara juni ban no basu ni no te toshokan mae de ori te kudasai. Mitsume des. So the woman says, Please take the bus number 12 from Honda Station and get off at Toshokan Mae. It's the third stop. So, Juni Bang means number 12. And Toshokan Mae means in front of library. However, they're talking about the bus stop. So it's, it's the bus stop that arrives in front of the library. Mitsume is the third one. So three in Japanese is san. However, if you're counting the stops, it will be hitotsu is one, hitatsu. It's two. And mitsu is third. So when you're like counting an object, you would say hitotsu, futatsu, mitsu. However, if you're counting off、um, any number, it'll be ichi ni san. So the woman answers mitsu me desu ne. Okay, the third one. A. Oriruto, mae ni kouen ga arimas. Toshokan wa kouen no naka no shiroi tatemono des. Yes, when you get off, there is a park in front of you. The library is a white building. In the park. <clears throat> so,、um, the woman, the purple woman, says to get off at Toshokan Mae, 
So this woman would see um, a park in front of her once she get off the bus stop. At the bus stop. <clears throat> and then she says that the library is inside the park, which is the white building. So we know that library is this white building right here. Oriru to mae ni means in front of. Once you get off, you'll see it in front of. Wakarimashita. Sore kara hon wo kariru toki. Nani ka irimasu ka? I understand. Do I need anything to borrow the book? Hon wo kariru toki means when I borrow the book. O namae to go jūsho ga wakaru mono wo motte kite kudasai. Please bring something that shows your name and address. O namae and go jūsho is the polite way of saying namae and jūsho, which means name and address. Hai, domo, arigatou gozaimashita. Okay, thank you very much. So, overall, we learned that the woman should take off at Toshokan Mae stop, and the Toshokan library is inside the park and the building is white and you need the identification um, in order to borrow the book okay let's listen to question sentence ごどもの時どこに住んでいましたか Now that we heard the question sentence, I want to introduce you two phrases. The first one is nan to honyarara something no toki, which means when something happens. No toki um, is used to explain something to people and um, if you take off this no, something toki could be used with verb plus toki or e adjective plus toki, na adjective plus toki, noun no plus toki. So let's go back. Um, so first one, kodomo no toki is noun no toki. Wakaranai uh, toki is um, e adjective toki. The second one is something something suruto. This means in such case or then. Something something suruto is conjunction and you would write the first sentence and um, you next you would write suruto and then write the second sentence so first sentence suruto second sentence so um so osake wo nomuto is um, first sentence suruto something happens so osake wo nomuto 
どうなりますか Well,、um, I'm going to explain this in more details, so please keep in mind なんとかとき and something するとき。すると。Um, なんとか means something in Japanese. So let's work on the first one. こどものときどこにすんでいましたか Would be When you were a child, こどものときどこに Where すんでいましたか Did you live? So There's the one that we learned earlier. Kodomo no toki. So there's the noun no and toki. So、um, we know that they're talking about this one. So when you were a child, where did you live? Is where did you live when you were a child? Kodomo no toki, doko ni sunde i mashita ka? Second sentence. Gai koku e itte, michi ga wakara nai toki, do shimasu ka? So the meanings would be like this. 外国 is overseas. 行って is went. 道 is street. わからない時 is when you don't know. And this one is e adjective plus 時どうしますか What do you do? So overseas went street. When you don't know, what do you do? Would be, what do you do when you go to a foreign country and you don't know where you're going? Gai koku e itte, michi ga wakara nai toki. Dou shimasu ka? Third sentence is, hima na toki, nani o So, this would be Hima na toki is when you are bored or free. And <clears throat> this one is na adjective plus toki. Nani o is what? Shimasu ka is do you do? So, when you are bored or free, what do you do? Would be, what do you do when you are bored or free? Kima na toki, nani wo shimasu ka? The fourth one would be, don na toki, taxi ni norimasu ka? The meanings would be Donna Toki is when do you? This one is na adjective plus Toki. Taxi ni is taxi or cab. Norimasu ka is do you ride? So, when do you taxi do you ride would be When do you take a taxi or a cab? どんな時タクシーに乗りますか The fifth one is たくさんお酒を飲むとどうなりますか The meanings would be たくさん is a lot. お酒を is alcohol. 飲むと is when you drink. And this says 飲むと but 飲む is verb. 
plus to, which means, which could be um, formed into the formula something suru to, because suru is also a verb. So all you have to do is put the verb plus to. So nomu to would be then or um, therefore or since then. Do narimasu ka? Do narimasu ka? Is what happened. So a lot of alcohol when you drink, what happens would be what happens if you drink a lot of alcohol? Takusan osake wo nomu to do narimasu ka? So now we learned some stuff from sh um, question sentence. Let's listen to short conversation. いち。すみません。アメリカの友達に電話をかけるとき、どうしますか?まず001を押して、次にアメリカの国の番号を1を押します。それから友達の番号を押します。わかりました。どうもありがとうございました。すみません。アメリカの友達に電話をかけるとき、どうしますか？Excuse me, when you call your American friends, how do you do? アメリカの友達 means friend from America, so American friends. 電話を this one is kakeru is verb which is to call so verb plus toki is the one that we learned earlier mazu zero zero ichi wo oshite tsugi ni amerika no Kunino first dial dial those zero zero one, then dial the American country's number one, then press the number of your friends. So, because it says mazu, that means first of all, zero zero ichi is o o one, and then after you would press the country code of America, which is one ichi o and then you press your friend's number. So, very simple. Um, so if my if I wanted to call my friend, I would press zero zero one one and my friend's number. Wakarimashita. Dono. Arigato gozaimashita. The woman says, "I understand. Thank you very much." So from this conversation. We learned how to make a phone call to American friend. Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. Sumimasen, Midori to Shokan wa doko desu ka? Eki no mae no michi o masugu iku to hashi ga arimasu. Hashi desu ne? Ee, hashi o watatte 100 meter gura iku to hidari ni arimasu. Okay, the man says, すみません。緑図書館はどこですか? Excuse me, where is the Midori Library? So again, from the first conversation, Midori Toshokan is Green Library. And どこですか is where is it? 
And then the woman says, Eki no mae no michi wo masugu iku to hashi ga arimasu. So if you go straight ahead on the street in front of the station, you will find a bridge. Eki no mae no michi means the street in front of the station. Masugu is straight. So, iku, and then iku to is verb plus to. So, it's similar as suru to. And then the man says, Hashi desu ne? Okay, bridge. E. Hashi wo watatte yaku metoru gurai iku to hidari ni arimasu. Yes, cross the bridge, go about 100 meters, and you will find it on the left. So, hashi wo watatte means after you cross the bridge. Yaku is hundred meter is meter gurai is about so about hundred meter hyaku meter gurai okay oh sorry um so from this conversation we know that the bridge is um across uh, the library is um, across the bridge and all you gotta do from the station is to walk straight um, go across the bridge and walk a little more and you'll find it on the left side okay let's listen to the next conversation はい。まずここにお金を入れてください。次にこのボタンを押すとカードが出ます。このボタンですね。わかりました。ありがとうございました。ボタンを押してからお金を入れるとカードが出ます。すみません。ちょっと使い方を教えてください。I'm sorry。could you please tell me how to use it? Tsukai kata is how to use. Oshiete kudasai is please tell me how. Hai. Mazu. Koko ni okane o irete kudasai. Tsugi ni. Kono botan wo osto. Kado ga. Sure. First, please put some money here. Next, press this button and the card will come out. Mazu means first of all. Koko ni is right here. Okane wo irete kudasai. Is please put money here. And then next, tsugi ni. If you press the button, another button, kono botan wo osto, another card is coming up. Kado ga demasu. Kono botan desu ne. Wakarimashita. Arigato gozaimashita. I see this button. Um, the reason why. Oh, never mind. So, sorry, I'm just gonna read it. I see this button. I understand. Thank you very much. Um, so, kono botan desu ne? Um, means, oh, it's this button. Okay, I get it. So, she's like reassuring that she's pointing the right button. And the narrator says, 
ボタンを押してからお金を入れるとカードが出ます。So after pressing the button, insert the money and the card will come out. So we know from this conversation that the woman is asking how to、um, use the machine to get the money, I mean, get the card, and the man is lecturing how to、uh, get the card. Okay, another conversation. Ni, ashita kara shichou desu ne. この資料がいりますかええ、お願いします。それからパソコンも持っていかないと。男の人は出張の時、資料とパソコンを持っていきます。Okay. <笑>明日から出張ですね。この資料がいりますか You have a business trip starting tomorrow. Do you need these documents? Shuchou means business trip. This、ね、is、um, a way to confirm to the person who you're talking to. Shiryou means document. A. o n e g a i s h i m a s So, the person who is in the house. Yes, please. I also need to bring my laptop. Pasokon、uh, is laptop. And Motte Ikanaito is a way of saying, like, oh, I need to bring this. But he's talking to himself. Motte Ikanaito. He's like, oh, I almost forgot. I had to bring my laptop too. So, motte ikanaito. And then, otoko no hito wa, shuchou no toki, shiryo to pasokon wo motte ikimas. When the man has to leave for business, he brings along his document and a laptop. So we know that the man is going for a business trip and he's bringing his belongings. Okay, last conversation for tonight. San, Yamada san, so you are not a man. I'm 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 not a man. 男の人はお酒を飲んだ時中国のお茶を飲みます。Okay. 山田さん、それは何ですか ?Mr. 山田、What is that? 中国のお茶です。体の調子が悪い時飲みます。So he says, it is Chinese tea. I drink it when my body is not doing well. Chugoku is China. Ocha is tea. Karada no choshi means your body condition or like your condition. Warui toki is when you're. Not feeling well. So this one is e adjective plus toki. So れもお茶ですか Is that also tea? いいえ、これは薬です。お酒を飲んだ時飲みます。No. It's a medicine. I take it when I drink alcohol. Nonda toki is verb plus t 
時男の人はお酒を飲んだ時中国のお茶を飲みます。Again, this one is also 飲んだ verb plus 時 The narrator said, the man drinks Chinese tea when he drinks alcohol. So from this conversation, we know that Mr. Yamada drinks his、um, Chinese tea and he also takes medicine when he drinks alcohol. So this is all for today. Thank you for watching this video at the end.、Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. If you have any questions or concerns, feel free to comment down below in the comment section. And I hope to see you soon again. Bye!